to a review of the chain rule. So recall from earlier in the semester when we were doing derivatives uh, that if we wanted to take the derivative of the function composition f of g of x, that this is the same thing as doing f prime evaluated at g of x and then multiplying by g prime of x. So we're just going to do a very quick review. And then in the next videos, we'll see how this uh, we can apply this to integration. Um, so again, quick review. If we have f of x is equal to two sine of three x squared minus four, we have an inside function of u equals three x squared minus four. So we are essentially looking at f of x is equal to two sine of u. So we have then that f prime of x is equal to the derivative with respect to u of 2 sine of u multiplied by the derivative of u with respect to x. And derivative of 2 sine of u with respect to u winds up just being 2 cosine of u. And then we are looking at the derivative with respect to x of 3x squared minus 4. Plugging in u on the left, we have 2 cosine of 3x squared minus 4. And then we are multiplying by the derivative of 3x minus, squared minus 4 is 6x. And so we wind up just with 12x and cosine of 3x squared minus four. So that's just a very, very, very quick review of uh, the chain rule. Again, in the next video, video, now we're going to go in reverse and see how this relates with integration.